In other news, it's been a month since a hit and run crash on Maui left a woman fighting for her life. This is video of Maui police apprehending the suspect, Jermaine Mudong. Maui police say Mudong suspected of rear ending Jillian Kroos and dragging her in the undercarriage of his car. Now Kroos's mother is sharing her daughter's story. The effects of that incident will last a lifetime as Kroos is now permanently disabled. KITV 4's Kristen Concilio has more on the story, including the fight for justice. It's been a month since Jillian Kroos was dragged more than half a mile by a hit and run driver on Maui. She's the latest victim suffering lifelong consequences for these crimes. My daughter is in almost constant daily pain and that's already on round the clock painkillers. She has procedures and surgeries about every other day, which cause her more pain. Jillian was riding her moped to work on May 16th when she was blindsided by a driver from behind and caught in the undercarriage of a vehicle police say was driven by Jermaine Mudong. And we believe that there was a higher power that saved her that day. Mudong was booked on first-degree negligent injury, operating a vehicle under the influence and other charges, but later released pending investigation. We had witnesses see the whole thing, all, all the way from the beginning to when the, the police pulled him over in his car. He should have never been released at all. Following his release, Jillian's family says Mudong fled to Guam, where authorities are waiting to extradite him. He was released without bail. And my daughter is still imprisoned in the bed. And at 32 years old, Jillian is now permanently disabled. Her backside still only has some skin on it. Most of the skin and scapula bone are, are gone. There was one day where she asked God to take her. So she's had highs and lows. And like other similar tragedies across the islands, the family's pleading for justice. We all collectively want to see um, the law looked at very um, meticulously, and we want to see um, more fierce uh, laws. Kristen Concilio, KITV4, Island News.